All right, so here we are at 124 13th Street. Taking a look, looks like they have a door, a window that's all boarded up there. Nice little backyard area, patio, the brick and the uh, concrete don't look too bad. All the windows. This is the side entrance. We'll go in here in just a second, but I want to show you the, the front and the street area. So this is a one-way street. Uh, traffic all going this way. And so we've had some updates here and here. And uh, both of these houses have been updated. So that's the street uh, that we're on. Right off of in between Scott and Greenup. So really good location uh, with lots of renovating happening. Of course, door is going to need to be replaced. And then everything's basically been cleared out. So you're talking about doing all of the all the finishing, but the drywall has mostly been put in. Some finishing stuff to do. Front door will obviously need to be replaced too. Looks like this may be wired for smart stuff. I'm not entirely sure what else is going on in there. But other than just needing a really good cleaning and then putting in a fireplace insert or something here uh, and finishing the floors or putting down new flooring. Uh, really? Pretty good looking on this first floor so far. A little bit of work here in the closet. Some signs of, looks like really old moisture damage. That may be a door that goes down to the basement. I'm not entirely sure. I certainly can't open it. Uh, but lots of Outlets and switches still need to be done. So I guess you can do that if you want to wire it for smart home usage or something like that. Uh, again, here's a closet. That, let me get a, a light on here. You can see, it just didn't quite finish the drywalling and, and stuff in here, but they've walled it all in. So, again, it is a closet, so maybe you don't finish that out. Maybe you do, just kind of depends on your preference. This would be the kitchen area, I would assume. So it looks like they didn't completely redo all of this. painted the ceiling here at some point, but it probably needs to be redone as well. <clears throat> Here's that back door. And again, the door is busted out. You can see the boards and there are some cracks. So there's probably a little bit of moisture and stuff that's continued to get in here. So this may need to be redone. This is just sub flooring in here. This isn't, uh, this isn't hardwood like in the front room. There's a bathroom area to be finished out. Again, this probably needs to all be just taken out and redone. That's where I guess your kitchen is going to go. Nice pantry space. Clean it up, fix the shelving. It's really dirty. Lots of dirt, lots and lots of dirt, but overall, uh, pretty solid looking so far. All right, so we'll go up. Again, the stairs could be, you could finish them out, you could put laminate over them, I guess you could put carpeting down. Walls have been drywalling has been done and mudded. 
Now we're on the second level. Some flooring. A landing area here. There is a third level we'll get to in a moment. Oh, looks like that goes back around to another room. Probably meant to be a bathroom here, maybe. <clears throat> I definitely put down some new flooring at some point, but it's been torn up. So yeah, this is all gonna need to be fixed, but they did do <laughs> the new drywall. Again, the windows don't look brand new, but they're definitely newer. Good condition. Closet. So I guess, I guess a bedroom. It looks like it's maybe supposed to have been a bathroom at some point, but everything can be wired here. Let's see. Oh, like laundry area and stuff. So yeah, there's your laundry hookups upstairs. Of course, that all probably needs a good check to make sure that everything is nice and secure before you finish it out and put anything in. And then here's the bathroom. So here's the bathroom. They closed it off. Sink. Toilet. Little linen closet space. Right. And then here's a window. So some finishing for the shower, but it's all this actually looks like it's a fairly new insert. Just needs the handles and everything to be finished. And a good cleaning door. Hey, there's an outlet. Ready to go. And then again, this goes up. We'll look at that in a second. So here's the big, the big room. So I guess you could call this the master or the owner suite. Again, all drywalled, mudded. The windows look like they've been updated throughout the whole, whole place. This one's not entirely closed. So, just gotta finish everything out. Looks like there was a, like a radiator heater there at some point. Uh, big room, really big room. Pretty decent closet space. Not super deep, but nice and long. Got the shelving, so you can fit a lot in here. I don't know what that is. Oh, oh, original closet door, I guess, that they kept for some reason. No. And then this goes up to oh, the unfinished third level space. Nice wooden steps and you can see the ceiling looks like they might be a little gap right there on the corner and everything so unfinished that's going to be your attic space vent right there but there is definitely new board down for the roof. It still might need a little bit of love in some places. Uh, but nice exposed brick wall. You could do a lot up here finishing this out. Turn it into a fun game room or bonus like hangout living space. Uh, yeah. It's a really big house. Needs a lot of cleaning, lots of finishing, but some of the big stuff seems to have been done. I might have to do a separate video of basement because I didn't see an access. So I gotta walk back through and figure out where that is, or if it's that door that was in the closet. 
figure out how to get that open.